Namaste and welcome to the second lesson of the chakra journey. Today we'll be focusing on Swadhisthan, the second chakra. Swadhisthan, or sacral chakra, is located in the lower abdomen, just below the navel and above the pubic bone. It is associated with the element of water and is often depicted as an orange-colored lotus flower with six petals. The energy of the sacral chakra is considered to be feminine, creative and fluid. The sacral chakra governs our emotions, feelings and sensuality. It is closely connected to our ability to experience pleasure, intimacy and desire. A balanced sacral chakra allows for the healthy expression of emotions and the enjoyment of life's pleasures. This chakra is strongly linked to our creati creative energy and the ability to express ourselves artistically. It nurtures our imagination, inspiration and the desire to manifest our creative ideas into reality. When the sacral chakra is open and balanced, it fuels our passion and enthusiasm for life. The sacral chakra influences our ability to form and maintain healthy relationships with others. It governs our interactions, empathy and ability to connect with people on an emotional level. A balanced sacral chakra supports harmonious relationships and the ability to establish boundaries. The second chakra is also associated with our sexual energy and reproductive functions. It encompasses both the physical and emotional aspects of sexuality, including pleasure, desire, and the ability to experience intimacy. When the sacral chakra is in balance, it can manifest in various ways. An excessive or overactive sacral chakra may lead to excessive emotions, addictions, or an overly sensual or materialistic approach to life. On the other hand, a deficient or blocked sacral chakra can result in a lack of creativity, emotional numbness, difficulties in forming relationships, or a disconnection from one's own sexuality. Through this practice, we are giving ourselves permission to experience pleasure in a healthy way, while reminding ourselves that the body is a temple which must be honored and taken good care of. Let's begin. <laughs> 